probably sleeping this morning. They're not up and at them yet. School hasn't started yet, but we know that they have a busy schedule. They got tutoring. They've got sports practice, those extracurriculars. So kids are getting up early with you to get to school early before that first bell rings. Yeah, and school officials say some of that is even happening during the summer months. New this morning, a new Illinois school speed zone law is now in effect to better protect kids. WGEM's Isabel Rossi is live in Quincy to explain how this could impact that morning commute, especially right now. Isabel, good morning. Good morning, Don. That new law makes the speed zone enforced earlier in the morning, so that'll now start being enforced at 6.30 a.m. instead of 7 a.m. And officials that I talked to just up the road at Quincy High School say that even during the summer months, they do have kids going to school property that early for things like sports practices to try and beat the summer heat that we are seeing right now. And like I said, that new law does make it go into effect at 6.30 instead of 7 a.m on school days and Quincy Senior High School's principal says it's not uncommon for students and teachers to start their school day before the first bell rings. Honestly, you're hard pressed not to find a time where there are not people in this building. Um, we have students arriving as early as six o'clock, um, staff here sometimes even before six o'clock, uh, but we also have early bird driver's ed um, that starts up at 630. A lot of times teachers will set up appointments with students to you know, get help, make up a test, that sort of thing before the school day actually starts at, at 730. Quincy Senior High School officials say they also have many students that walk to and from school and many of their students that are new drivers. So it's important for drivers to be aware of speeding and distracted driving when in school zones. And engineering officials from the city of Quincy say they likely won't have time to change the school zone signs uh, with the updated information before the beginning of the school year. They say their plan right now is to put stickers over the signs that currently say 7 a.m. to make those say 6 30 a.m. temporarily until they can get those signs replaced permanently. Live in Quincy, I'm Isabella Rossi, WGEM News.